Hey there, so today we have another review and this is a beer courtesy of Paulana. Uh, they sent this one out for me. This is their Hefeweizen, so this is 5.5%. Uh, this one comes in a 16.9 can, so let's dig into it. Uh, I reviewed this one recently, I wanna say, because they sent it to me, but let's dig into their Hefeweizen again. Extremely carbonated style, so that's one thing to uh, think about. Also, it is a wheat beer, so it has a uh, great head retention to it, so. Head creation. Making a mess over here. Anyway, the, the beer comes in a uh, deep gold to, actually it's a pretty dark for Hefeweizen. I know that uh, BJCP has the style actually pretty light. I solidly disagree. I mean, this is, you guys look at it. It's a decently dark beer. Like this is not a super pale straw colored beer. This comes in definitely in a deep gold color. Yeah, medium to deep, deep gold color. Uh, has a medium haze to it. Almost looks like a East meets West Coast New England IPA. Obviously Hefeweizen is sort of like the original uh, <laughs> New England IPA, but uh, beautiful, fluffy, fluffy white head on that. Let's get the wrong. So it clearly is Hefeweizen. It has that kind of uh, ripe banana nose. Uh, not ripe banana. It's more like, what is that? Yeah, it's a little bit of runts. It has a candied sweetness to it. It has kind of dough quality to it. It's a dough sweetness. Almost like a vanilla and marshmallow kind of sweetness to it. But it's like banana pudding. There you go. And then really not dominated by the clove. Sometimes you get bubble gum in these. Faint hint of that, but mostly the banana runs and that kind of like banana pudding thing. Cheers. On the palate, fruity. It has um, a little bit of that bubblegum uh, chew to it. That a little bit of that pink bubblegum thing. More of that kind of banana runs thing. It has a little bit of like a, a neutral, not overly sweet, but kind of medium banana flavor to it. The clove jumps in a little bit. You get a slight mint, a uh, hint of this kind of like toast that comes in. It's got a little bit of uh, toasty breadiness to it, which is pretty interesting because the beer generally is a very light kind of wheat beer, but this is a, I mean, you clearly see it's a little bit darker. I think that could be issues of oxidation, of them sending it all the way out to the US. Yeah, this was canned about seven months ago. So it's very possible that that's the issue. So that actually triggers, it might be oxidation uh, causing the darkness in the beers and the fresh have vice and should actually be very pale in uh, light gold to a uh, straw color, but. There's almost a little bit of snappy, like kind of minerality on the back end as well. It has a little bit of bubble gum, a little bit of fruitiness. The fruitiness plays into almost like ripe, kind of like um, uh, uh, stewed pears that you might use in a dessert. So there's that fruitiness coming in. Uh, a little bit of malt complexity on this one. Uh, nice and a little bit of like a medium mouthfeel. It has that fluffy wheat thing. It's half bites and it's half bites. Um, I know people like, you know, always say like, I don't like the style, I don't like that style, so therefore the rating, blah, blah. This is not one of my favorite styles. I will give you guys that. And as I wait more, there's a little bit of that clove thing and it almost hints towards a light hint of smoke, but not really, not like there. It's just like a hair almost over there. So it's that kind of like phenolic thing uh, playing in this one. So um, as for rating, it's a very good Hefe, it's in, yeah. Hmm. Definitely not my favorite. Though then again, I, 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 I'll I post in the uh, comments below about like, you know, some blind Hefe and videos that I've done, but. Uh, this one for me, it's a good half uh, It has its uses. I think it would be uh, a decent pairing beer or something where, you know, you want to break up a session, but it's not something for me that I generally reach towards. So 86, 86. This is Paulana, their half Post in comments below about what your favorite half is. Until next time, guys. Cheers. Later. Thank you, Paulana. Later.